forever. Uh, I do have some good news to tell you guys. Yes, Biden won. <laughs> That's really good news. This past weekend I was just like partying it up with my friends. No, not partying. We were just celebrating. Um, my friend had a barbecue. We like ate did some karaoke. And then the next day I went hiking with my friends. It's called Minenwaska. Minenwaska. I cannot remember the name of the place, but that's where I went. And the really good news is that I booked something. Yeah! So, the story begins. You know how I've been auditioning for a lot of things, some really, really good things. And that's because I signed with my manager back in June, although I didn't know that I was signed with them back in June. <laughs> I mean, it's complicated. It's because, so for like really big management companies, apparently they have this thing called like a verbal agreement where you don't really sign a contract, but you have a verbal agreement that for me, like, oh, that you'll be my manager and I'll be your client kind of thing. And then you just do the handshake and then that's it. So like my manager back in June was like, Oh, Yana, we really like you. We would like to be exclusive with you. But because she used the word, like, we would like to, I thought she meant, like, later on. Like, she's going to, or she's most likely going to later on. So I knew that they liked, they were interested in me, but I, I didn't know that, like, that was signing. I was, like, so confused. And then in September, my manager visited New York, and she was like, let's have lunch or something. So. I was like, oh my god, is this the day that I signed with them? And then while we were talking, she was like, oh, I know things are tough, but because I'm representing you, blah, blah, blah. And then I realized, okay, hold up. Are you representing me? And then she was like, yeah, remember the conversation we had back in June? And I was like, oh, oh, oh. Yes, uh, so I am signed with Brillstein. They are the ones who've been sending me all these really really good auditions. They're cool. You know, my manager represents some famous people, okay? But that's not the good news. I mean that is the good news, but um, the good news that I'm saying is that I, I booked something. I can't tell you guys what because um, they can't proceed with filming my scene right now because somebody in the team got COVID so they had to stop filming. But once they resume, everything will be fine. I just need to wait. So that's the good news. But another important thing is Columbia finally released our virtual showcase! Yay! It's out everybody. I'm so happy that it's finally out. Yeah, I'm super super proud of my class. I really think that we did the best that we could in this situation that we're in. So please check it out. I'll put the link below. Yeah, so it's been a good few weeks. Things are looking a little better, more hopeful. Definitely more hopeful. I mean, the day that Biden won, I like, I woke up from people screaming outside. I was like, what's going on? It was such a different vibe from when Trump got elected. And it was just really nice to see people celebrating outside. And, and I'm really thankful because I think with Biden winning, it will definitely help me. Or it will give me a better chance of staying in the United States, I think. Uh, but yeah, um, I just wanted to do this talk with me video because um, I know I've been a little inconsistent in terms of putting out videos. I've been trying really hard to put something that's more consistent, but with like auditions, honestly, they just come up randomly. I have a very inconsistent schedule, so it's been hard to put out YouTube stuff consistently. But I tried, but I realized like maybe posting two videos a week might be a little challenging for me right now. So instead of two videos, I'll be posting one video a week. It will be on Thursday at 5 p.m. Oh. <laughs> and with that, I burp. I'm also thinking about doing uh, like a study with me videos. I'm just thinking about doing that right now because I want to motivate myself and by putting myself out there, you guys keep me accountable and I also motivate others to get on that horse and do it. <laughs> I mainly want to do it because I've been wanting to write for the longest time, but 
you know, I get distracted. I'm like, I need to draw. Today I need to go out. I need to do puzzles, whatever. I'm up with all these distractions. Well, they're not distractions. They're things that I like, but uh, I think right now I need to prioritize writing things because I think I really want to make my own work. And I want to write consistently so that I can come up with a final product, you know? So I might be doing those study with me videos and if I do, I'll post them on Wednesday at 1 p.m. But those will be a little bit more inconsistent. But the one that I'm posting on Thursdays, that will be consistent. And I know I keep saying this, but I will be doing more music covers. It's just hard because I don't know how to use any of these like music software stuff. I'll be doing more research and um, figuring it out. I honestly get pissed off because I'm very sensitive to sound and whenever I put on music covers I'm like this is not how I want it to be but I need to put something out there so then I just do and then I want to erase it immediately so and, you know practice makes things better I'm just practicing you know so anyways I just wanted to give you guys a little update I'll see you in the next video